take men out of the center of your life and see what that do for you. Stop, stop centering men in your life and see what that do for you. And I'm not talking about all these men. No, I mean, if you want to be a better woman, be that for you. If you want to be a healed woman, if you want to be a soft woman, be that for you. If you want to be a Kemp woman, a provided for a woman, a, a protected woman, hell, find ways to do that for you. Because when you're able to set that tempo for your self, it becomes that much easier to see who don't know it, to see who can't dance to it. And, and, and so many people, and it's not just women, so many people have not placed into their lives the thing that they demand so they don't know how to recognize that in the real world. If you That's got walls up, mama, you would never know safety if it's set in your lap because your walls are more important to you than safety you feel me and I'm not saying you wrong for that that's just where you are on your journey but you putting that on somebody else you don't feel safe mine that's up to you you feel me is that's that's your discernment you feel me and we 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 get off on that like oh yeah if a man was leading properly a woman if, if submission is not natural it's a learned skill yeah it's a learned skill. You have to learn how to be a good follower. That's not natural for anybody. Most humans are actually yeah. born selfish. Your parents teach you submission, you feel me? So like putting that on some dude or some like that, you got old that you need to fix. That ain't no new fault.